Chaos in the Iraqi parliament in the midst of a vote on amendments to the election law. After a heated session that ran late on Sunday night and into the early hours of Monday, it was finally passed. The legislation means provincial and national government representatives will be chosen on the basis of proportional representation. In our case, it will preserve the rights of the main components of Iraqi society and prevent the instability created by the multiple constituency system in the last election. But opposition lawmakers say it favors larger, more established political parties at the expense of emerging blocs and independent MPs. Protests against the changes took place in several provinces as well as in the capital, Baghdad. Independent MPs and protesters say the previous election law was one of the major victories of their demonstrations in 2019. They fear these amendments will reverse that gain and increase their political repression. There are already calls for a boycott or the dissolution of parliament. We declare we will be boycotting the elections and will not take part in any proceedings related to the amended law. If tensions escalate as they have in the past, Iraq would be on the verge of another prolonged political standoff. A very possible scenario is the return of the 2019 protests, this time with the Sadrist movement making a second comeback. Alongside the opposition, if that happens, we may see another political deadlock. Putting Iraqis' hopes for political and economic reform even further out of reach. Mahmoud Abdul Wahid, Al Jazeera, Baghdad.